imagine this is my first and last video I just die after filming this video Hello everyone and welcome to my channel Okay that was so loud I'm gonna start again Welcome to my channel everyone and by everyone I literally mean the three people watching this Hi how are you? If you know me you probably know me from my Instagram underscore make by Salva and if you're here to learn the perfect cut crease highlight contour sis you're in the wrong place you should go to Nikki tutorials channel because she's the queen but if you want to learn how to kind of do your makeup keep watching this if you want to know how to do this look and I'll see you in a minute so bye I mean not bye I'm gonna see you in like a second just stay keep watching and I'm back as you guys can s okay stop Okay, as you guys can see, I've already done my eyebrows because I already have thick eyebrows. Using my M433 brush. So now as a transition shade, I'm taking okay, this color. Oh, I hope you guys can see. Okay, now on a fluffy brush, I am literally swiveling this eyeshadow a little below my actual crease. So by the time we're done, everything will look really blended. Now I'm taking this rusty brown color on the fluffy brush again and I'm emphasizing my outer corner and my crease in a wee manner you can say. I swear to god you guys I did not get into a fight with anyone it's literally just black eyeshadow on my arm. Anyway I'm taking this dark brown color and I'm trying to give a winged effect on the outer corner without an eyeliner basically. Okay, seriously you guys, it looks like I got punched in the freaking eye. Okay, now I'm taking a flat concealer brush and I'm cutting my crease a little above my actual crease because I've hooded eyes. That's why I have to do so. Otherwise, um, eyeshadow will transfer to my upper eye. Does that make sense? Yeah. Okay, so I decided to channel my inner sadness and go in with the blue color because, you know, I'm feeling a little blue at 4.30 a.m. while editing this thing. And I'm using this matte blue color as a base for the shimmer blue color I'm going to apply later on, like right now with my finger. I mean, this looks cute, right? I mean, yeah. Okay, now I'm taking this dark brown shade and I'm literally just packing it on on the outer V of my eye because I want everything to look blended. That's why I'm taking this clean fluffy brush and I'm just mixing and blending all the blues and the browns so nothing looks really harsh in the end. Okay, you guys, it's been three years and I'm finally done with my eye makeup. Now we can jump into the face makeup. Oh, by the way, the lashes that I used are... The pinky goat one, they were really famous back in like 2015 <laughs> and they're really good. I'm using the the ones called Erva, I think. Okay, now I'm going to be using my Rimmel uh, primer. This is really good. I mean, I barely use any other primer, so I don't know what to compare it to. It has SPF in it and I think that's supposed to be impressive, I guess. Okay, now I'm going to go into my favorite foundation. Actually, I'm going to mix two of my favorite foundations. This is the Born This Way uh, Too Faced Foundation in Vanilla. I'm not very good at this. Vanilla. And I'm using the Fenty Beauty Foundation in 300. So I'm mixing them both because, well, this one's way too dark on me. So here I go, just a tiny bit. And this, guys, I swear to God, this is the best foundation ever. Like, I'm gonna repurchase this. It's like high coverage, but like, it doesn't mattify your face. But at the same time, it's not very, you know, dewy. So it's like best of both worlds. Okay, now I have it all over my face and it's gonna look so good. Okay, imagine I look like an Oompa Loompa when I'm done. I really hope it doesn't get into my hair. Okay. Okay, chill. Okay, now I'm using my LA Girl Concealer in natural. 
me. I'm so natural. Okay. I should have straightened my hair for this video. Fun fact, I never brush my hair. Maybe once a week. Like, I shouldn't have to brush my hair. Oh, but I did for this video, so done for the week. Okay, that was such an Instagram thing to do. I can't believe I actually did that with a straight face. What the hell is wrong with me? Seriously? And now I have a freaking heart that isn't blending. Come on. I'm gonna use my Maybelline Fit Me powder. Yeah. By the way, guys, come on. Like, I don't wanna like start a thing. <laughs> they look so alike. Um, which one came first? Uh, did I mention it's the Corelle Beauty Elixir? It's really good. Okay, now we're gonna contour. And if you wanna be a little dramatic, you can take your brush into a curvy manner and go up, okay? Like this. This is my NARS blush in Amour. This is my favorite blush ever, you guys. Like, I don't know why the orgasm blush is so popular. Like, no one talks about this one. It doesn't have any glitter in it. It, it is matte, which is perfect if you, you know, go to university or school or college or whatever as well as a well workplace. Because I don't think anyone wants to look. I don't think anyone wants to look glittery then. And the orgasm one is a really glittery. I can't even say glitterly. Glitter, glitterly, glitterly, glittery. It's glittery, not glitterly. I'm so embarrassed right now. Am I going to add this in the video? Yes. We're gonna take a clean brush now while our baking is, you know, getting done and everything. I'm gonna take my hula bronzer again and we're gonna contour this nose, this big ass nose. <laughs> Now my nose looks a little, a little snatched. Okay. Let's apply my Jeffree Star lipstick in Celebrity Skin. This is such a beautiful color. It's like a mixture of pink and nude. And it's literally empty. now the same colors are used from my uh, transition shade and the uh, last one i'm gonna add them to my bottom lash because i feel like that makes your makeup look so professional and you know and now for the for the final step highlighter i'm using the iconic becca champagne pop highlighter this is the best highlighter in the whole world i swear to god oh yes by the way, I also put this highlighter on my inner corner and my brow bone. Like just before. What else? A little of my nose. I don't like going all the way down. And lastly, my forehead. And we're done. Hello children. And oh my god, we're done. I hope you guys had fun because I really want you guys to have fun while watching this. I'll see you in my next video if I don't die. Bye, see you later.